What's going on guys, Greggles TV. If you have a Chromebook, you might be wondering how you can remote control that Chromebook from another uh, computer or tablet or Android device, whatever it may be. Well, you can do that and this is great if you have parents or people that aren't really good with computers and you wanna help them up by remote controlling in to their device. So what you're gonna do is have them open up Chrome and you'll do the same on yours. Open up the Chrome app. And in the Chrome search at the top here, you're gonna type Chrome Remote Desktop. Now that you have it up, you're gonna click on the top link that says Chrome Remote Desktop Chrome Web Store. And then once you have it open in the top right here, if you already have it downloaded, you'll just hit Launch App. If you don't, you'll hit Install. So get that installed. And then once you have it installed, open it up. It's gonna bring you to this screen where it's gonna ask you if you wanna share this computer so that another user can see and control it, or do you wanna see and control another shared computer? You can also access your own computer from anywhere setting up uh, so that you don't need access to access your own computer. You can access it whenever you need to. But what we're gonna do is act like we need to get help on our Chromebook from somebody else. So what you're gonna do is hit share, and it's gonna give you a special code. So what you're gonna do is, on the other person's computer, you're gonna access that code. So let's do that. So on your other computer as well, make sure you go to Chrome Remote Desktop Chrome Web Store. It's gonna bring you to the same place you had before. Install the app on your computer, and then hit Launch App. And it's gonna bring you to the same screen uh, you were at before on the Chromebook. Instead of hitting Share, you're gonna hit Access. And you're gonna put in that code that's on the Chromebook. Click connect. And on the Chromebook, it's gonna ask you if you wanna share, so you're gonna click share. And I am now accessing my Chromebook. So you can see I, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna hit X on this little window down here. And then minimize this Chrome window. And I am officially on my Chromebook. And I'll show you, you can see at the bottom, this is the Chromebook down here when I hit this. It's gonna show me all my Chrome apps that I have on here, Android and Chrome uh, book apps. So if I wanted to open up something like the Google Play Store on the Chromebook, I can. Now one thing I noticed is on the Chrome apps, on the Chromebook, it's pretty sluggish. You can see I'm moving my mouse and it's kind of slow. So it works, it's just a little bit slow and that happens in the Chrome, uh, in the uh, Android apps as well. So let's just close this out. So again, you can access the, everything about this Chromebook. You can click in here and go into the settings and check out you know, the network they're connected to, if Bluetooth's disabled, uh, if you wanna go into settings, anything that you want. So this is perfect if you wanna be able to help a family member or a friend out who needs help with their new Chromebook or actually any computer. This app, as long as they have Chrome installed, they can install the Chrome Remote Desktop and you can control their uh, computer with this for free for as long as you want and it allows you to offer them support. If you guys have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe. I will see you down the road. Peace.